One day, these two YouTubers get a big idea for a video. The idea is they want to see if they can secretly stay overnight in Target without getting caught. Now, their names are Saucy and Honey, because of course they are. So Saucy and Honey head to a local Target right before closing. Then they head to the back of the store and they build themselves like a little box fort to hide in. And they hide themselves in there and then they wait and they wait and they wait. And eventually they hear the closing announcement and then boom, the lights go off. Target is closed. So there they are, alone in that big store. So now what are they gonna do now that they have hours to kill? Well, they play around in the store. They act like mannequins. They even get a little bored. Seven more hours in here. The Target opens back up at eight. But finally, morning comes and the store is about to open up. It is 5.44. Nobody has came. This is stressful. I think we deserve 50,000 likes. Then suddenly, the lights turn on. The store opens and they leave their fort behind and they simply walk out. We just successfully spent the night in fire! Until... So Saucy and Honey go home, they edit all their footage together, and then they post that video to YouTube. And it becomes their most watched video they've made. Like a lot of their fans enjoyed watching it. But you know who else enjoyed watching it? The police. So police suddenly just call them and they're like, yeah, we saw your target video and that's trespassing and we're gonna press charges. So how do police know about the video? Well, as it turns out, Saucy and Honey didn't really spend the night at Target. They actually left through an emergency exit around 3 a.m. I, I guess to go home and get some sleep. But when they left, they accidentally set off the silent emergency alarm. So police, they see that the alarm's going off so they show up to Target and they search the building and they don't find anything because Saucy and Honey have already left. Then. And hours later at 8 a.m., once Target has opened, Saucy and Honey come back to the store and they pretend to the camera that they had been there all night. And because that alarm had been tripped when they left, Target employees review all the security footage and they give it to police. And like this story makes the news, it kind of blows up everywhere, and people start flooding their comments, just roasting them. You didn't stay the night in Target? You lied to us! They seem more like Walmart people. Now eventually, after all this criticism, they make a response video. And they seem a little annoyed at all the negative attention. You being combative like that and attacking people really, really, really makes me wonder who you, who you are, are as a person. person. And they also implied that the news media was lying about about them leaving Target. Believe what you want to believe. They also claimed that they were never arrested. Anyway, here's their mugshots. Now, allegedly, they were charged with criminal trespass and banned from every Target in Pennsylvania. At the end of it all, I think they just got a fine. And this all happened like a year and a half ago. Shout out to Pennsylvania.